This alien technology looking automation handles any kind of reply a lead might throw at it. Any objection, any question that a lead might have, it will be able to handle it. So let me just show you this thing in action and let's talk about how to set this up. So I created this test campaign. I uploaded my own emails and uh, I sent this cold email. I feel impressed by how company has achieved that. You can read it. And uh, once I sent it, let's say lead reply as sounds great to me. And you can't see any reply here because the flow was inactive when I, when I was testing it. So I had to activate it again and then I sent it. And then I replied again, let's say lead replied as tell me more. So this is the reply we got from our automation. Great hearing back from you. Happy to explain our performance basis process to do it proper justice and show you the value clearly. It really works best over a quick call rather than back and forth emails. How about a brief chat? No sales pressure, just a straightforward look at how it works. As you can see, this is a really good email and you can see a meeting link over here. And you can also notice uh, there are two Arun, so I fixed it in the prompt. So then let's see let, let's see if a lead come up with an objection or uh, any kind of question, how it's going to handle it. Let's say your lead says, if it costs initially free, only then I will book the meeting. This is an objection. So this is the kind of reply we got from our automation. Understood our performance model focuses on results. We only succeed if you do long term. There's an initial commitment involved which ensures resources are fully dedicated from day one. The structure is different from typical retainers and minimizes your risk. Happy to walk you through exactly how that works on a brief call. Here's the meeting link. This is a really solid email. As you can see that we are able to have a conversation with our lead. So this automation is designed to have a conversation and, and craft the next best email in such a way that it leads to a booked meetings. So unlike other automations, it is not using any kind of pre-made template, which works just for the next email, but to have an entire conversation, uh, for that, I just designed this automation. So how to set this up? I won't go much into the technical details because I myself don't know much about anything. I just build it, uh, step-by-step -step looking at tutorials, but unlike that it works perfectly. So we are starting with the webhook. You click on it. Click on production URL, copy the production URL, click on it and it will be copied. Go to instantly, go to settings, go to integration, go to webhook, add webhook, put your production URL here, select the event type as reply received. After that, select your campaign and add webhook. That's all you got to do and go to API keys, go to version one, copy your API key from here. So once you copy your API key in the next HTTP request node, Leave everything as it is, put your API key here. So this HTTP node is fetching all the email details such as lead name, email ID, uh, the email you sent and the email we received. So anything about email, it is receiving that. So put your API key here. After that, it is going into this next node which is marking the lead as red. So put your API key here as well and you don't have to do anything other than that. It's going into this filter HTML, which is organizing the uh, output coming from these nodes uh, into a clean looking output for our LLM. So it's going into this LLM chain where we have this one prompt. This prompt is classifying the email as what the lead is trying to say. Lead shows interest. Lead wants to be removed from list. Lead doesn't see the value. So things like that, it is classifying that. So based on that, it is setting it as category. So once we have that, it is going into the switch flow. This switch flow is uh, splitting the flow into seven parts based on lead response. So let's say lead shows interest. It's going into this flow. So we are only dealing with the leads which are neutral or shows interest. We are not dealing with any kind of lead who is not interested or anything the lead is saying, which is not relevant for our business. Let's say a lead says I'm out of office. I am not available. I left the company. Anything like that is going into this miscellaneous flow and it is stopping here. And if the lead is neutral, like asking for more information, uh, asking for the price only then it's going into this main flow. So it's going into this main flow. So this is our email writer. You don't need to do anything here. You just go to the second prompt 
and change the business context here so whatever your business is your service or product put uh, put information about your business here you can paste your landing page over here as well so anything that makes the llm understand about your business put it here and another thing you need to change this name from arun to your name that's it that's all you got to do after that it's going into this email cleaner we don't want to send email with other jargon we need to send the email as clean as possible means ai sometimes give the output as here is your output so we don't want to send that as well so we are cleaning that so all you need to do here is change this meeting link here so it is also embedding the meeting link which the ai is going to use in the email so change the meeting link from here once you do that it's uh, converting the response from this llm into html then it's going into this wait node we are waiting for 5 minutes then it's sending the reply so put your api key here as well you just grabbed it from here put your key api key here and uh, save and press active that's all you have to do and uh, you can test it on a test campaign you can just create a test campaign in instantly and uh, test the flow if you are satisfied with the response then you can put it on the main campaign